this one. Yeah. That's a shape. Finish your one. F1. Do you know what happened? Paper lock. So you had a little too long of an engagement zone? Yes. Okay. It was okay. And you had your purple up, you had your white up. Yeah. Sometimes when I'm using, I was going around a curve on, a, on Danny's tooth mm -hmm. today. It was about 120 degrees. I did it with F1. Mm -hmm. But I did the purple and the white, I'm like, I'm like, uh, I'm like this. But when I went with the F1, I'm, I was just back like this. And as long as that F1 will feed really slowly, let it go. Mm. But if you have to get up here and start to help it, it's going to break immediately. But I put an, you can ask her, we put an F1 around about 120, 130 degrees, and we have a cone fit, and we, I don't know if she packed it. So really probably brush more with your purple and your white, and that will reduce from this to like this mm. or this. And that'll reduce your engagement zone, and then you don't have such a, a long engagement zone. Oh, and maybe there's a, a little twist. Also. Well, there is for sure. Yes. See, this is not, the canal is much more dangerous than this looks. Mm. This canal already so. is going like this. And then, then at the end, I'm seeing it go like this, mm -hmm. and I don't even know what it's doing. Buckle lingual. Oh. This is just mesial distal. So this is a nasty canal yes. and it has multiplanar curvature. Yes. But you have wonderful shapes. You must yeah. be thrilled, huh? Yeah, these are nice. Yeah. Oh well, I want to see that one. Oh my goodness. And you got a furkle canal? Yes. And you went around a nice curve coming down here. This is good. This will be interesting to see if you get bone fill. Yes. And you have a little pocket here, so it probably comes down around like this. Mm. We'll see if that works. But no perfs inside the tooth, huh? Everything's good. I bet it's your furcal canal. Yes, I think so. Yeah? You hope so. Because there is there perio around the mouth, or is it an isolated perio isolated. defect? Then it's probably endo, it should heal. Mm. Yes. We're optimistic, <laughs> cautiously. <laughs> and then I have just one last question. This was also nice. This yeah, that was good. Four in a row. Oh. Four in a row. <laughs> this, is, this is great endodontics. This is, this is exciting. See, there's two canals, two separate portals of exit, maybe one, maybe two lateral canal here, something at us or away from us. There's breakdown in here, good shapes. The shapes are proportional to the roots. They're nice, they're not too big, they're not too small. You probably would tell me you like this puff better than that puff. I like them both. <laughs> a puff is a puff. There's a puff, there's a puff, there's a puff. This one's bigger. But you don't know down here what's going on. You could have three exits. You could have four exits, you could have two exits, but it looks complicated. And we can't see it perfectly because it's hidden inside the sealer. But if it's sealed, the body can tolerate surplus after filling, it's irrelevant, absolutely irrelevant.